Michelle, your next one's up right now. First one on our next sheet. Man, why do I have a hard time? There we go. I think Brooke got Mewtwo earlier. Oh, maybe. Perhaps. Uh, I can scroll up and look. Did she really? That's really amazing, actually. <laughs> she did. She did! You're right! Brooke, you're having a good time with this break. You're getting, like, the best cards. Let's see what we got for Michelle here. Oh, Rapidash! Rapidash, and unfortunately, that one is off-center. So this is another reason why cards from this set in a PSA 10 are just more valuable because uh, even though it's minty, even though we're peeling it right off the sheet, it's immediately not a 10 because of centering. Kind of like how English can be, you know? Coming out of the pack, not a 10. Nothing's guaranteed. It's a really nice card though. Yeah, they're super glossy. Do they have a weird texture on the front being stuck to those? I've never seen these before. Yeah, so they don't have any stickiness. They're actually really glossy. And then the back here very waxy so I really don't know how they're stuck to the card it's obviously some type of adhesive but whatever it is it's not sticky I mean, it's only on the sides yeah I've heard that it's barely on the sides and uh, that's why I guess I don't know if it's true but I've heard a couple people say that the reason this set gets weird edge wear is because of the adhesive it, like eats away at the edges I don't know if it's true though no idea if it's true or not really nice though that one's going to Michelle she seems, seems to have pretty, 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 like. yeah they do I mean that's the thing is the, the edges are protected which is nice because they, they're not on the edge of the sheet all right two more on this sheet start off with Rapidash I don't know you think it's a Safari Zone sheet or Anthony is up next with another another card Yeah, that one was really off-center. That was easy to tell. That would be a, a 9 for sure because of the centering. Unfortunately. Okay, what do we got here? Alright, good luck to Blue Shirts. To Anthony. Getting a gold bat. Oh, man. Look at the centering on that one, too. Do you think the whole sheet's off-center? Do you think that's how it works? We'll have to see for the third card. Because Rapidash was off-center as well. Anthony with the Golbat. I don't know if he got a Golbat earlier. Hopefully not. He's got a bunch of cards here. Um, checking real quick. He does not have a Golbat. So that's good news for Anthony. Okay, we have one more on this sheet. This one is going to Suli. Good luck. Going to Masalix. Rapidash, yeah, I have no clue what this is. Go back, Rapidash, and if it's, I wonder if it's gonna be off center. And it's off center, it's a Dotrio. It is off center, interesting. So the whole sheet was pretty much the same centering, all really drastically to the right, I think. So going to, yeah, so there you go. I love the artwork though, it's really unique. Another sheet finished. All right, we're, we're getting down to it. You guys will have to let me know. Are you enjoying this break? Would you want to do another one? Pricing would be very similar. I'm hoping. Nothing's guaranteed. I gotta try to find some first. But once I uh, try to find some. I'm hoping we can do it about like we did this time around. All right, Brooke. Brooke with the ridiculous luck is up again. Your luck tonight is killing me. Can we do it again? So far, Brooke has picked up the Mewtwo card and the Bumblebee Pikachu, two of the best cards in the set. These are so off. I know those ones were so off, right? Let's hope that the rest are not like that. We're starting a new sheet right here. Good luck to Brooke. Oh, a Rattata! 
Eaten some cheese. I've never seen this card before. I love it, actually. Grattata, huh? First one we've pulled tonight. Very cute. I love it, and it's it's luckily not off center. So hopefully that means the entire sheet is nice and center since uh Rattata is nice and center. Okay, give me a second to find a uh, rook here. Tata going to Brook. We have two more on the sheet. Up next, I've got Suli. Another one for Suli. We just did one for Suli, getting the Do Trio. Hopefully, we'll get a more centered card this time. Uh, like it sounds, Red Tata. Maybe. <laughs> Doesn't have to be perfect. As long as I can tell what it is. I can't believe I got Pika and Mewtwo and only getting three spots. I know you did really good. And that Rattata, that's the first one we pulled, too. It was really cute. You did awesome. Um, Do we have the tag and an ultra break at the end of this? Yes, Spoon. That would be next. That would be next. Okay, Suli, what do we got for you? Oh, it's a Squirtle. Fantastic. We got the Charmander earlier. This is the first Squirtle we've seen. I really like it. Squirtle, adorable Squirtle going over to Suli. At least one more on this sheet. And it is going to Eric S. Not Sniffy Doodles, other Eric. So Rattata Squirtle, I don't know. I really, these are supposedly based on locations, but um, Rattata Squirtle, I don't know. Feels like Pallet Town. Suli so will be happy. Does she like Squirtle? That's awesome. All right, last one on this sheet is a polywag. So that is the second polywag we've seen. Very nice centering on this one. Going to Eric S, I believe DX founder, the better Eric. <laughs> the better Eric with a K. All right. And Anthony, again with two cards in a row, starting a new sheet for Anthony here. So, so far, Anthony's has two doubles, an Eevee, and a Weedle, if I remember right. I get a triple. I know, let's not do another double, a triple double. You can keep the lippy Poliwag. Poliwag is weird, right? Kind of a weird Pokemon. Gen 1 Pokemon kind of have, like, you know, they just get favoritism because they're Gen 1. Like, we're all so used to them. Even though when you really start to look at their design and think about it, they're kind of terrible, like Grimer and Muck. Because they're Gen 1, we're all good with it. Alright, anyway, Anthony, taking an Abra in a tree. I really hope that's not a double for you, but if it is, I guess you'll have a Abra in a tree for trade. And Anthony actually has another one coming up right now. Abra in a tree, and I don't know. Where do you find Abra? Isn't he by Cerulean City? I think you can get Abra in the game corner, too. All right, Anthony, what do we got? A Porygon. Which we did see a Porygon earlier. I have no clue if this is a double for you at this point. Let's see, Anthony, I got you down for Pinsir, Doduo, Eevee, Caterpie, Weedle, Zubat. Okay, I feel like you did not get the Porygon, so that's good. At least that's a new one for you. We're getting down to the end, guys. I have a complete Gem 1 collection. Sailor Graham, that's fantastic. We 
are on to card number 45, going to Todd, going to Pi. Really hoping we don't get doubles. That's the goal on these vintage breaks, is really just to not get people doubles. Todd got the other. Okay, good. Other polywag, polywag? Porygon. I guess went to Todd. So Todd's up again. I don't think you can get two on a sheet, so this should not be Porygon. Oh, it's Poliwhirl. We have not seen a Poliwhirl yet. We've seen a Poliwag and that one Polyrat and uh, one Poliwhirl. Very cool. 